Hello and welcome to Yoga with Subhash. In this segment, we will practice a, a one of the breathing techniques. It's called just simply rapid breathing. In Sanskrit, it's called Nadi Sanchalana, which literally translates to activation or movement of the nervous system. So basically, it's energizing the nervous system. And in, in, in English, we just call it rapid breathing. Now, if you recall, our normal breathing pattern is about 15 to 17 breaths in a minute. That's the normal breathing for, you know, depending on your own breathing cycle, that's the, the, the approximately the rate of breathing. In the rapid breathing sequence, we increase that rate to close to 100 breaths per minute. Okay? And this practice is usually done first through one nostril, then through the other nostril, nostril, and then we practice it through both the nostrils. Now, when you do the practice, make sure you do not strain yourself, because everyone will have a different capacity of, as to how many breaths you can do in one round. And any time you feel uncomfortable, any time it feels strenuous, stop at that point, and then switch over to the next nostril or through both the nostrils. Okay, and also the way we do that is we make a Vishnu Mudra with the right hand, which is to make a fist, lift the thumb up and the, the last two fingers up. That's the right hand. With the left hand, it's the, sh, it's the chin mudra, which is just to in, join the index and the thumb together, and the hand is resting very comfortably on your knee or your thigh. So let's start by closing the right side and breathe rapidly through the left nostril. So let me just give you a little demonstration first. So we're going to start by closing the right side. And the rapid breath will feel and sound like this. So if you notice, the characteristics of, these, of this breath are that one is it is a very even breath. That means there is no force and they are evenly distributed. The inhalation and the exhalation are the same duration. And we try to keep the breaths gentle and soft, but even, no forcing of the breaths. And also the, the thing to remember is it's upper chest breathing. We do not engage the abdominal breath here. So it's not Kapalabhati. Okay? So we, in, we only breathe through the upper chest and breathe very even and soft breaths. So I will do about 60 breaths from the, the left nostril, then take a few gentle breaths, then I'll switch to the other side and do another 60 breaths, and then do both nostrils. So just follow along with me now. So in this one, we keep the spine upright, relax the shoulders, Eyes are closed and then just breathing in and out through the left nostril first. And finally, exhale completely and just take a few natural breaths here before you switch over to the other side. Okay, and now we are ready for the other nostril. So we'll use the ring finger of the right hand, same Vishnu Mudra, ring finger, close the left side and we'll breathe rapidly through the right nostril now.
And again, release the hand, exhale completely. And then bring your breath, breathing back to your natural breath for a few more breaths. Just relax breathing. And when the breathing is back to normal, we'll do the, the same rhythm, this time breathing through both the nostrils. So again, close the eyes, sit up straight, and then begin with the breathing through both the nostrils, rapid breath. Exhale completely, then get back to your natural breathing pattern. So I, in this, uh, uh, in this uh, demonstration, I showed you about 60 breaths in each round. And you can, like I mentioned, you can start with maybe 30 to 40 breaths if that feels comfortable. And then slowly build your capacity so you can do about a minute, which is roughly 100 breaths. Uh, on each side. So 100 breaths through the left nostril, then 100, 100 breaths through the right nostril, and then the same number through both the nostrils. Okay, so that will be your rapid breathing pranayama technique. As I mentioned, this is a technique which really energizes the entire nervous system, makes positive energy in the body. I hope you enjoyed this demonstration of rapid breathing pranayama technique, and I hope you will include that as a part of your on, on individual ongoing practice. Namaste and have a great day.